What's good, everybody? Welcome back to channel. My name is Don Fiction. I've seen this post on Twitter, as you can see what I'm kind of hovering over. And it's a post from Dexerto, and it says, this high school is unreasonably large. And for a guy like myself, coming from a very, 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 very tiny, small high school, I just gotta see. Welcome to Carmel High School. Join us on a tour. This is the auditorium. <laughs> this Damn. Is the Damn. This is the planetarium. It's the senior hallway. You got a whole ass planetarium? You got a planetarium. You got a planetarium. Why the halls so so big? Man, if y'all seen the size of our halls, <laughs> they were big, but they I don't think they were as big as that. This is our Como High School Library. This what the? This is the Oz hallway. This is the Carmel Cafe and Market. You got a cafe? This is the Carmel Cafe. And this is our Carmel Cafe where we have Teddy. And this is the Carmel Varsity. That is a junior college. Where, where I come from, that that's bigger than a junior college. Laney College, Alameda College, their uh, basketball stadiums weren't as big as this. That's crazy. This is a new addition to the Hall of Fame. This is the freshman gym. This is the weight room. <laughs> if y'all would have seen our weight room, our weight room could fit in the corner of that weight room. <laughs> really could. Damn, I'm not even mad. I mean, good. Kids need this stuff. They need it. They need it to, to have fruitful, successful high school experiences. You know what I'm saying? But damn. Room, baby. See, for us, we didn't have like a, a, a place to do wrestling. You know, when you had PE, you know what I'm saying, physical education, they just pulled the mats out on the basketball court. That's what we did. And it might have been one or two. <laughs> this is the blue and gold gym. Look how many ribs there are. God damn. This is the blue and gold track. Okay, see, where I live at now, we have that in our city center, but not like in the school. This is the field house. Did you see that shit? Excuse my language. This is the varsity tunnel. This is part of our wall of success. That's cool. This Damn. is the hallway of fame. This is our three story freshman center. You got three stories for the freshmen? My high school, we had a corner. Literally had a corner. This is CHTV. This is our live radio. Oh, come on, man. I couldn't do that until college. I'm not, I, once again, I'm not mad. I'm not hating. I'm actually happy that they have all this stuff because like I tell my kids and I've had this conversation on live streams with Zach and, and a, bunch of, a bunch of us that I talk to a lot. If I, as a young person, experience things like this and had this stuff, my life decisions, my career path, my career choices would have been so different, so different than what I chose. Things I, I, I like doing and I, I, and I really enjoy doing, I didn't figure out I like doing them until I was so much older because I never got a chance to experience those types of things like doing the radio. I didn't experience that until I was in my 20s. You know what I'm saying? Like till I was in my 20s doing TV. 20s. Even though I was still young, but just imagine if I would have experienced that stuff at 13, 14, 15, 16. You know what I'm saying? Oh, it would be so different. This is the yearbook room. You have a yearbook room. No, they, they just took our art class and made it to the yearbook room. This is the auto shop. See, if you want to do that at my school, you actually got to go to College of Alameda because then you can do like an AP class for mechanics, but then you got to have good grades to even get out of school early to go to Alameda to do that. <laughs> this is the wood shop. Oh, that would have been awesome. Main cafeteria. Damn, he said main cafeteria. <laughs> this make my school feel like a baby prison. Oh my God. You said the main cafeteria. This is the bookstore. This is one of the many cooking rooms of Carmel. That's crazy, man. The Decker room. The Decker room? <laughs> it gets some full. Okay, so that's who they probably put it out. But re regardless, like I'm, I'm not even mad about the fact that they have this. I'm very happy for them. I just wish as, you know... <sighs> One of those things where as time progresses and things get better and more compact and technology just booms like crazy, the more you look back and look, damn, I was born in the wrong generation. 
every time. I was born in the wrong generation. But that's, I think that is cool. I think the fact that they have all that stuff is utter amazing. It's like, uh, of course, I'm shocked. I never thought I would see a school with that much stuff. Like, even when we came here to Texas, like their stuff, they got a lot of stuff. But that, I think that school is probably two and a half times the size of their high school. That's crazy. That's humongous. But that's dope. I don't know. I just decided to react to it. I don't know why, but I'm glad I did because that, that's crazy. Peace out. I don't know why I did the long blink. That was just stupid. <laughs>